Hey, welcome back to Good Guardian Canine Working Dog. My name is Alton. I have another video for all of you. Hopefully you enjoy this one. And just before we get into the video real quick, I'd really like to say, you know, life is quite short and um, all kinds of things are happening in the world right now. And just in case some of you are not aware, no matter where we are living in the world and what color we are, we're all human beings. We're all one on this global platform. And, uh, you know, take a step back and really examine your own personal life and maybe find some place inside of you where you can start to be good to people if you weren't good to people in the past or start being a little better to one another. I see so many people fighting on the internet over foolishness, over things like what is a pit bull and what is not. It's a waste of time. None of us were there when the breeds were created. And none of us are an authority or have knowledge beyond the present that we can determine which breeders were lying and which breeders weren't. We know for a fact that they all did, as you, all human beings lie. So, let's take the time to address more important things and to help one another and to take care of people, regardless of your race, you know, and your class in terms of your financial status. Regardless of those things, take care of one another. Look out for a person, even if they're a stranger. Because when you're looking out for another human being, you're taking, you're taking care of yourself. I just thought I'd share those few words with you. So let's be better human beings to one another. Again, take care of yourself, take care of your families. Enjoy the dogs, enjoy the videos, and I'll see you in my next video. October 2000, we got uh, one of Blue Bionics and Sky Blue Daughters. We call her Miss Thang. Come here, girl. She's 10 months old. Watchdog Zoo Stud. His name is uh, Hammer. Hammer is off of uh, some real tight Big Thor Blue Bunny breeding. This dog was bred on Great Van Killer's yard. This is Hammer. Real athletic dog. Real strong prey drive.
got hammer time at stud. Stud fee on all dogs is $700. You can see hammer online, www.mvn.net slash chaos. Go to the stud page. He's uh, 15 months old, out of a uh, blue bubble and spicy breeding. This is a full brother to Killer B. We call his dog Blue A Baller. We got pups off him on the yard and pups on the way. Due in November off of this dog. Also, Naughty by Nature has a female, Shady Lady which was bred by this dog, too. His pups is due November 25th. This is the Blue Ape Baller. show you later on in the tape. We're expecting, expecting pups out of them too. Bitches too. This is three or 
around. Young stud. Go around all three, my friend. Mm -hmm. Show all three. Three of my young studs. You got Kelly Bay here. The Prince over here. And blue eight ball. Right here. All right. This is a double bread blue bubble bitch. This is the dam to Prince, Angel Fire, Bruce Lee. an image of a mother, the late Blue Rage 187. Blue Rage and Blue Bubble Brady. You call her your majesty. Come on. Very thick female. This is the kind of female you're looking for. Looking for a female that looks like a male, give me a call. Don't waste your time with the rest of y'all. This is Tonka. Tonka is a double bred Conan dog. So this is a blue bully red woman breeding another big door. Watched out big door and watched out blue bully breeding. He's an inbred stud dog. We bred him into a double bred blue bubble bitch. Angel Far. Should produce some good dogs. We call this dog Tonka. He's my latest stud. He should produce some real good ones. As you know, Conan was an excellent dog. Double bred Conan. Time double bred blue felsy bug breeding. Two November. All right. I call him. About it, about it. Registered name, Rowdy McCoy. Stud dog is two years old. He's off of a voodoo times blue bubble breeding. I have a female on the yard off of him. Looks just like him. Inferno Angels Pips in uh, Wisconsin. They have a a son off him called Rowdy Two. 
aka Diesel. This is a very hard mouth, hard drive dog. This is a combination of Watchdog Mason and McCoy breedings, all three put together. And this is what type of dogs that we're actually aiming for. McCoy dog. He's out for some of that little desert breeding. I come from Marty Rosmus. I call him Mad Max because that's what he is. He's a mad man. <laughs> Max, Max, get him, boy. Get him, boy. It's a youngster. He's about uh, eight and a half months old. Him to be at least 85 to 90 pounds full grown. Well built dog, a lot of, lot of ability. Real hard drive, too. Max. Good boy, Max. This is Mad Max. I have Max's little mate sister, too, we call her Cosmo. Take him out. He's trying to look good, ain't he? Right. This is a blue bubble, simple breeding, simple coming off of a Capone and a Bossy Boo. This female here is a 15 months old. We have we have our bread in the sky blue right now. Should produce some real nice dogs. This is a blue bubble daughter bred back in the sky blue. Same breeding we've been doing for years, which been producing majority of all these dogs. That same type of breeding, sky blue and bubble cross, makes excellent dogs. So this is a daughter off of bubble bred back in the sky blue. She's due in November if she took. You can see her on the, the breeding program on the website on the puppy page. And also you can view the parents and grandparents and great grandparents on the picture pages. We call her Buffy. Buffy. Taffy and Harley breeding. Taffy is a straight Mason Chapman hog, bitch. Bred back into a Carver Eli uh, stud dog. Harley come off of Champion Blue, which Champion Blue was the grandfather to Grand Champion Shep. So this is a Mason Carver Eli cross here. All right. Quarter Rascal dog. Call him Folk. He's off of Deja Vu, bred back into Rebel. Acts real good. He's about 15 months old. So is the Mason 
Eli Carver Cross Dog. They're all about 15 months old. I have a little mate brother to this dog, a black one that uh, I'll get rid of. Asking 900 for his dog, little mate brother. I'll show him to you later on in the tape. This is three quarter Mason Champion Hall and one quarter Rascal breeding. This is not your friend. This is definitely your foe. Call this dog here, Mercy. He's a he's off a tenth Devon with your dog here, Mercy. He's a he's off a tenth Devon, which is a Grand Champion Yellow breeding on top and Major Champion Hall on top. Angel Fire, Cold Blue. This is the sire to Miss Thang. Baby D. And probably some more around right here that I ain't figured out yet. <laughs> He's eight and a half years old. This is off of a Green's Rambo, which was owned by Bootleg Kenner, bred back into a Persinger's Molly B, which was bred off of Watchdog Blue Glory, which was another Blue Bully, a Blue Max 2 breed. Sky Blue, his sister is Buzzsaw Rosie. Also, his brother is a uh, Blue Ball, which is on Hughes' Chaos Kennel of Illinois, of Kentucky Yard. This is my old stud dog here. Still producing good dogs. I have a litter that's two, three days old off of this stud dog. Bred back into a bus, saw rosy bitch. He got seven pups in there off of this dog. I got another litter that's four weeks old off of a... Uh, a voodoo bitch bred back into the stud dog. They're all in the weapon room. And a litter is due in two days off of the same stud dog. So he must be producing some good ones to breed them that many times. 
So if you're looking for a good dog, this is where it all started. Sky blue. Good boy. dog on my website called Tank. Tank is available for stud too. Right. A young stud. This is a this is a young stud. We call him hotball.com. This is off of Duke Nukem and Voodoo Breeding. Hotball is about 14 months old, red, red nose. He's a clown too, as you can see. He should produce some nice red nose. I got some red nose females coming up to breed into this one stud dog, him and Hammer. This is hotball.com. Dog Mason McCoy breeding here. Young dog. Should be this excellent pup. I have some more pups off of Voodoo bred back into a Rosmus dog. Red nosed females is coming up that I plan on using this dog to stud into one of the two. This is Chaos's Hotball.com. Do some nice red red noses. He's off of this neblet, this neblet red nose. Where this line come from? So we starting us up a new red nose line of dogs. It'll be mostly McCoy blood line mixed with a little bit of the wash dog blood into it. And occasionally we'll mix some little uh, mason in it. So I have a red nose, uh, seven eighth mason dog, and an eighth Carver Eli. And it got that red nose from that Carver Eli part. The bitch pulled it back. So we're gonna be using her in a breeding program later on too. Some of these red nose dogs and stuff. We use the Mason Hog stuff pretty much for the gameness of the dog. We like to wash dog stuff for the mouth and the drive. And the McCoy stuff has a lot of ability and a hard mouth and a, and a hard drive too. And a combination of all three together, you get pretty much a complete dog. These big dogs are used for working pit bulls. They use it in working areas. We use them for catch dogs. Weight pool dog, protection dogs, American Street Ring Training, Home Invasion, Person Protection, Canine Law Enforcement, Occasionally Schutzen, and Weight Pools, all types of working areas is where these big dogs are used in. You go online, you can find out where and how to get your dog trained in person protection, American Street Ring, 
You can see it on a website on www.mvn.net slash chaos. Click on the American Street Ring links. Hotball.com. All right. This female here, this is off of a blue book, Bubba and the Brat breeding. We call her Blue Bionic. Got off the chain the other day and ran into this little mason dog right next to her. And got her in the chest. But uh, it's a good thing I was out here. Because Blue Bionic, bitch, don't play. This is Blue Bionic, bitch. Blue Bubba female. Excellent dog. Real hard drive. Thank you. 